This is how to properly wash your dog at home. Already have the water running in the bath at a good temperature, and then put your dog in so there's not such a freak out when the water starts. I'm using this shampoo. There's a lot of great products you can use. Just please don't use this one. Always start with washing the dog's dirtiest areas first. Dog's eyes are super sensitive, so when washing the face, make sure to not get really anything in their eyes, even water if you can. Scrub in circular motions like how you would wash your own hair, and make sure to really get the shampoo into the coat. Even if you just got your nails done, please don't start to scratch the shampoo in the dog because this can actually irritate their skin. If you noticed, I still haven't made my way to the body because I have to wash all her legs first. Unless your dog likes to roll in dirt, the back of your dog is usually the cleanest. So we're going face, feet, butt, underneath, and then finally the back part of the dog. My dog Ginger is mostly good for the bath. She will try to sneak her way out if she can. If your dog doesn't like the bath, go slow, bring treats, have a calm vibe. It's super important when rinsing the ear to not get water into the ear because moisture in ears leads to infections. It's crucial after you fully rinse off all the shampoo to condition. After this conditioner bottle gave me flashbacks to things that are better left not said, I worked the product into her coat everywhere and then I usually let it sit for about like five minutes. If you have one of those showers where the head can like detach and you can rinse that way, perfect. But if you don't, I usually get like a little cup to rinse. Thoroughly rinse product left in coat can also cause irritation. And before you pull out your old hair dryer, towel dry your dog like as much as you can. If your dog is still dripping water, you're gonna spend so much more time drying, I promise. Use the hair dryer to blow, brush, and comb through your entire dog. If your dog doesn't like it, you can brush a little bit, then blow a little bit, repeat until it's dry. And now your dog is all done and ready to get dirty again.